Hey gearheads, welcome back to BZB TV. This is Nate back here from the tech support team bringing you another video. In today's video, we're gonna be featuring our AV over IP, our IP gear 4K system. And there's a lot of things the system could do, but today we're gonna to be focusing on one of the major features is the KVM technology and how this could be very useful in certain environments. It's like secure computer labs, because setting up a computer lab um, could be a very daunting task, especially with kind of uh, limiting access, kind of trying to oversee uh, secure materials, um, physical access, and also trying to keep that um, when you're in full operation, try to keep that high quality but low latency of everything running smoothly. Fortunately for you, BCB Gear has a solution with our IP Gear 4K AV over IP system, especially with the KVM technology that offers, this will be a perfect solution for all your concerns. With some of its major robust features like supporting 4K at 30, PoE capability, HDMI 2.0, HDCP 2.2 compliance, as well as the ability to support video wall function, as well as video matrixing functions, and including that it's TAA compliant. This is the ideal solution for building secure computer labs, even for government facilities or companies with high privacy and security concerns. The primary goal of a secure KVM lab is to limit physical access to the computers and to monitor and control how they're being used. Common methods of KVM is IP KVM or doing KVM through the network, which is our system allows. Um, and so this allows for remote access or control over the physical computers at the, at the location, but you can do it from one workstation through your network. So by utilizing the KVM technology that the IP Gear 4K offers that allow for just that to remote access, to have control, to have everything in a, a single remote uh, workstation and control everything your network. So for today's demonstration, we're going to show how the KVM works, where to plug in. And uh, as you can see, I have a few computers behind me and they're going to act like uh, those are the computers you want to try to monitor and try to remote in and limit access to. So let's dive in. First thing with the transceiver, as you know, it can act as a transmitter or a receiver. We have multiple of these uh, set up in our rack and just turned on as a transmitter receiver. And uh, But more importantly, what we're talking about today is, uh, like I mentioned, is the KVM. And each, each transceiver uh, has a host port and um, a device port, which is the peripherals. So what we did is, what we're going to do is, you're going to post. So we, all we did was with our laptops, plug them directly into the host via USB 2.0 3.0 supports both and then um, your devices would we plugged into our receiver um, which is going to our TV I just plugged in a little wireless receiver that for my mouse and keyboard uh, so that's how easy it is and then and then just out each laptop has a HDMI going out to each uh, transmitter and then once you log into the um, the web GUI or the web interface of the AV over IP you can easily just switch what computer you want to monitor so I can go ahead and show you that now. Now that we have everything hooked up and everything is networked and all the USBs are in the right ports and HDMI and all that fun stuff, we're gonna go ahead and log into our login page here for the web interface. All right, and here we go. This is our web GUI. As you can see, we have we have three uh, transmitters and one receiver. Obviously you can have multiple, many, many more trans transmitters and receivers, but for today's demo, we have three computers hooked up. Those are our transmitters and then one main display. And so KVM is so simple. All you have to do is just drag and drop. So if I wanna go over to uh, put my Mac on the display, it's gonna go ahead and go ahead and drag and drop it. And I'll take a switch. And boom, there is our Mac. And I'm using the same exact uh, mouse and keyboard for this. There you go. As you can see, I have this. And then I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and drag and drop my second PC onto the, re the receiver. Give it a second and boom. Now we're on our uh, other PC and I'm using the same exact um, PZB gear keyboard and mouse and look at that 
oh, I want to go to this website. There you have it, gearheads. As you can see, the KVM function is really easy to use on our IP Gear 4K AV or IP system. Just plug in your uh, host, plug in your peripherals, and everything connected. Um, this is a great setup for giving the giving you the owner the admin the most control and overseeing and making sure if you want to limit access of the users um, you can do that as well another great thing about this setup it allows for growth it allows for you can add multiple more computers more uh, receivers more transmitters um, more uh, admins if you want or maybe just one or multiple computers uh, you can do that as well and lastly the best part of here at bzb gear we're really confident in our products that we offer demo trials, demo units that could be sent to your facility. So if you want to try it out, give it a test run for a couple weeks, feel free to reach out to uh, one of our sales associates, uh, even here at, here at support. Um, if you have any questions or anything, we'd love to just put some stuff in your hand and see how, how we can serve you, how we can offer some help. And as always, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you, answer any of your questions or uh, any, hear any of your feedback. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to videos like these so you'll be notified when more videos like these become uh, when they come out. And as always, have a great day.